Jones. I am here to do a different thing for you today. I'm going to do an unboxing. Um, I attempted to do one last week. However, the item that I was shipped was defective. I had been shopping for a portable air conditioner because last summer, on the last day that it was actually scorching hot, my portable air conditioner broke. Fortunately, it did not get hot again. It continued to cool down and I was so thankful. I figured I'll just wait until January or February and buy another one, hopefully catch a good sale. And so that's exactly what I did. Now, the one I ordered last week was by a company called Trustech, T-R-U-S-T-E-C-H. And I'm going to show you that box right now. That's the portable air conditioner that I received last week. Defective. I opened the box. And the bottom of the box was filled with oil that was leaking all over, all over the floor. So um, I called Amazon and they transferred me to the company. I just have to tell you this story real quick so that you don't buy Trust Tech products. Um, they transferred me to the company. They tried to transfer me. There was no answer at the company. It was a little bit later in the afternoon, so I figured... You know, maybe they're closed. It was like 5.30. Maybe they closed at 5 o'clock. So, the next day, I tried to call Trust Tech three more times. No answer. It would go to a voicemail that did not allow you to leave a message. I emailed them three times. No response. So, I went back on Amazon and I emailed the company through Amazon thinking, okay, well, they'll surely respond to that. They didn't. So I had to call my credit card company, tell them that I suspected it was fraud. They don't even want their own broken product back, but they took my money. So my credit card company gave me credit. I went back online shopping again Walmart this time and I found Air Max cheaper and also um, 14,000 BTU the trust tech was only 10 and it was $50 more so I'm stuck with this trust tech I guess uh, for free it looks like because they haven't contacted me to get it back and you know, they're not responding. I'm trying to get it back to them, but they won't respond to let me know how to ship it back. So it looks like I'm stuck with a broken air conditioner. And if I don't get a response by summer, I'm just going to throw a few dollars into it, get it fixed, and then I'll have an extra one. That's all I can think of. But right now, I'm going to do the unboxing for this new one. Uh, my first intention was to do a mukbang for you. I was going to do... Uh, five hot dogs in five minute challenge however we had a Super Bowl potluck at work today and I ate a little bit too much so I am going to do that challenge for you but it will be this weekend instead of tonight I don't think I can eat another thing so we'll do this unboxing instead uh, might as well get started. Let's see what we got here. Let's hope that there's no oil in the bottom of this box. You know, Amazon's usually reliable, so, I mean, I don't really blame them. I, I blame the company, Trust Them. But I, I think Amazon should not allow that company to sell their products 
on Amazon anymore. So my intention is to call Amazon back and let them know that. Like I said, this came from Walmart. So um, I'm expecting good things because I uh, purchased from Walmart online before and if there was ever anything wrong, they fixed the problem immediately. So cross your fingers, pray for me that there's nothing wrong with this. have it secured much better than the other one that I got. This is part of the vent that goes out the window. And here is the other part. This attaches to the first part that I just showed you. And this does also. Here is the window fitting, it's adjustable. And the air conditioner is a very nice looking machine. Very nice looking. I am just going to cut this box. to hang on to that. Okay. 
in this room for you guys. It's um, 80 pounds, so a little bit heavy. It is on wheels. I just need to get it out of the uh, styrofoam first. And voila, what do you know? No oil. No oil leaking from the Air Max. You just get a little bit of this paper out of here. And there you have it. Very nice looking machine. Packed very nicely. And I am going to, um, I'm going to plug it in and see, make sure the motor's fine, make sure it's running. Right? I'm going to open the directions first. Comes with a nice remote control. This is also a heater, so it's uh, air and heat. So I'm hoping that it will save me a few dollars on my gas bill. It even comes with its own batteries. I just wanna make sure that there's nothing I have to do before I turn it on, you know? Sometimes it tells you before you run this machine, do this or that. So I am just gonna check and see. It is running. It's not loud at all, which is great. Perfect. And there you have it. The Air Max Portable Air Conditioner. Um, of course, I have to hook up the hose, put it out the window for summertime. Uh, but I'm going to read the instructions a little further and find out how to use this baby for heat. And maybe save a little bit of money on my gas bill, like I said before. So thank you for joining me for this, my first unboxing. And you know, I'll consider doing another unboxing if and when I buy something new again. But thank you for joining me. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, and like this channel. I will definitely be back with a mukbang for you. Tomorrow is going to be a surprise mukbang. You guys are gonna love it. So please tune in tomorrow. I will see you all soon.